Hey everyone, Tony K. Everybody, more Tony's Pokemon Soul Silver Adventure. On the last episode, we, uh, shit, what did we do? I think we just walked through a uh, national park, you know, about some trainers and what have you, and then we walked through here, through like Route 36, continuing. And, you know, about some uh, more trainers, and then tackled a wiggling little tree that was here. And then I think an egg hatched, and there was a Tokopi, a weird, strange being. And yeah, now. Yeah, trying to obviously read that last time. And then we're on Route 37. Route 37. So let me just check my team, because I think. Yep, okay, it's fine. So, what? so we got a double battle ahead of us. I have to get right in their faces if I want to do this. Anyway. Let's battle! Alright, I'm bringing out a Pokemon! Oh my god! You... you want... A Mer Meryl and a Marie. Okay. So this is a great matchup indeed. Okay. Well, let's just do this. Yeah. I are smart. Great. Just what I needed. Oh, no, that's brilliant. I love, I, love, I love that. Let's just get everyone paralyzed. It'll be fun. Come on. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Um... And then I do have a Paralyzed Heal. Yes, I do. Okay. Go away, Mareep, you annoying little... I was gonna call it an annoying little asshole, despite the fact that I have a Mareep. It's evolved now, but I did have a Mareep. So, I mean... I have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about. Uh, just... I'm not even gonna bother trying to... Kill Romelia. Yeah, great. Just keep going. Nice. Hey, yeah, we really did something. Good job. And there we go. I lost. I lost. Okay. Switch you around, I guess. For you, or maybe, maybe you. Now keep you around. Um, okay, so carrying onwards, we got another double battle right now, I think. Yep, there you go. Oh, you're a cute little trainer. Why don't you battle me? Hey, hey, hey there, you young trainer. Won't you battle with me? Well, fine. If I have to. Har Harley and Cassandra. Oh dear God! It's the Moonstone Gang, I think. I, um, I'm pretty sure Clefable. Oh, Clefairy had to evolve, evolve into Clefable for I Moonstone. I'm pretty certain. I'm sure so does Jigglypuff into Wigglytuff. I know, like, a few episodes back, when I was, like, when we got that moon bowl from Kurt, and I was, like, going over the, the Pokemon up until this generation that can evolve via the moon. Oh, thanks, Clefable. But, you know, the uh, Pokemon that can evolve via the moon, so I did list them off, and, uh, you know, shit memory. Can't remember if I said, uh, Jigglypuff could or not. 
Uh, okay, just that and get rid of Echo Fable. It's annoying me. Get out of here, you. Oh, God damn it. Good. Okay. That's no longer a nuisance. And... Oh, great, two wiggly stuffs. This is gonna be... Tough. No, you just know. Anyway, take a pounding, because it's one... No. It's not once with the quick claw activated, but that's fine. It doesn't always work, you know. It's not a guaranteed thing. Why have I not used Rock Smash once? Um. Shit, I kind of want to use it on the Wiggle Tough with the more health, but I think it's you. So in that case, I'll do Quick Attack on you. I think. No, shit. Wrong one. Fuck. Oh well. Sing miss, that's good. Don't want that. Don't want to fall asleep. Ugh. And Clefable. So that's fine. They have a. They both have a Clefable and a G, uh, Wiggly stuff. Um, wait, what? Where was this? What did this happen? Oh, no, I'm matching. Oh, what is it? Memento. What does that do? Okay. What the fuck just happened? Wiggly, no, uh, Clefable used... <sighs> Mento, Memento, whatever. Met well, it used Metronome and it became Mento. I don't know that move, obviously. But apparently it made me lose my special attack. Not my attack, because of Hypercutter. And then it died. That's great. Well, didn't have to deal with that stupid, uh... Dubical Fable then. Okay. There's a couple of super potions. We're getting close. Yeah, we're getting close to uh, our next destination anyway, so. Just. Um. Oh, brilliant. 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 Uh, it's just a pity. Felt like we've, uh. Haven't sent a bajillion of those so far. I'm sure one more will be just fine. Okay, well. So that place, uh, close to that place. But, why do that when we can come over here, shake a couple of trees, stroke them nicely at a fast pace, and pop, comes a red apricorn. A black apricorn. A blue apricorn. And after all that shaking, ugh, really hurts my arm. Who are you? Pokemon can't do a thing if they are asleep. I'll show you how scary that is. Oh no! But you're wrong though. If said Pokemon has the move Sleep Talk, then they can do a thing while sleeping. I'm just saying. So I'm gonna throw a drowsy my way. Ugh. I wasn't lying. Did put my Pokemon to sleep. It would have really help if Shadow had a uh, dark time move. So yeah, not great. It's fine though. It's fine. Just sleep it off. It's, it's fine. Mm. 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 
Okay. Great use of your turn, Drowsy. Or, you know, more importantly, the trainer giving Drowsy the commands. I'll show you how scary it is when a Pokemon's asleep and can't do anything. Aha! Now it's asleep. Now I will use Disable, despite the fact that it won't do anything since the Pokemon didn't is asleep and didn't use any moves or of any sort. So just keep using it though, keep using Disable, keep using it, that's good, oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What a stoop. Anyway, oh, pal. Just gonna quickly throw up one of those, so I can get through this bit. There you go. And this background. And now we're on Ecrotic And now I'm gonna go heal and I'll explore this place. Or not, as it seems. I forgot about this guy. Hi, I'm Bill, and who are you? Hello, stranger who just decided to introduce himself for particularly no reason whatsoever. I'm Ryan. Hmm, Ryan, huh? You know what? I'm the one who developed a system to transfer Pokemon. Jeez, wanna fucking brag much? But it couldn't have been done by me alone. For example, do you know the Hoenn region? This scale, L Lynette from Hoenn made the Pokemon storage system easier to use. My friends all over the world are working together to improve the Pokemon trade and storage system. I have to hurry on back to Goldenrod and see my folks. Bye bye. What a self indulgent prick. Just wanders from nowhere. You know, comes up to me, introduces himself, tells me what a big wig he is, and then just fucks off. What an asshole. So nice to running into that asshole. Let's probably explore this place now. I'm going to rehearse at the dance theater. Care to join me? No. So, Akritik City looks nice. It's got a Pokemon Mart. That's... Like I said, nice. Anything of important in here? If you use a revive, a Pokemon that has fainted will wake right up. Thanks. My Eevee evolved into an Espeon, but my friend's Eevee turned into an Umbreon. I wonder why. We both were raising our Eevee in the same way. Yes, well, as you can clearly see, sir, I too have an Umbreon, and it is quite simple. Clearly, you raised your Pokemon. Wait, which one did you have? Did you have the Umbreon? I don't know. Anyway, either way, one of you raised your Pokemon to its maximum happiness and leveled it up one time during night, and that is how I got my little Umbreon here. Yes, these are some pointless shelves. But regardless, it seems that you or your friend was raising your EV to its maximum happiness during, and then leveled it up once during the day, and that is how one of you got said Espeon. It's very quite simple. What's in stock? Air mail, healable, and neville. Oh my god. The letters are so pointless. And I know your typical crap. Um, a couple of soup potions, I guess. Soupy potions. Okay. There you go. Yes, please come here. So, your typical Pokemon Mart, obviously. And um, a lot of other people. Hmm. I thought I just heard a woman screaming or something. Is that just me? Yeah, I didn't hear anything, so... I mean, I don't know. Ecrotique used to have two towers. One in the east, and one in the west. <clears throat> don't resisting the urge. Don't worry about it, don't worry about it. Anyway, um... If you go west from the city, you'll reach a port called Olivine City. When your Pokemon learns Surf, you can go out to the ocean from Route 40 without a ship. What a bunch of useful information. Thank you, kind sir. Um, oh, 
That's a nice Pokemon you're walking with. They make you feel uplifted, don't they? They give us the hope of the light, so to speak. Speaking of the light, I heard something about the lighthouse in Olivine. The Pokemon that serves as the beacon has fallen ill. Sounds like it's in trouble. Ah, oh, well, that is quite a problem. Maybe, you know, if you use something like, I don't know, a giant light bulb instead of a Pokemon, maybe that might work. This happened when I was young. The sky suddenly turned black. A giant flying type Pokemon was blocking out the sun. I wonder what that Pokemon was. It was like a bird, and like a dragon. Like a bird dragon? Dragon bird? Is there a Pokemon? Is there really a Pokemon that big? If it exists, it must be powerful. Well, just because it's big doesn't mean it's powerful. I mean, if that's the case, fucking Whale Lord would be an unstoppable force! Anyway, um. The tower that used to be here, I heard that it used to be much taller before it was burned by fire. Let's see. So, what do we have here? Burn Tower. It was destroyed by a mysterious fire. Please stay away, as it's unsafe. <laughs> Stupid sign. You don't tell a kid to stay away from something dangerous. Fool. Clearly, I'm going to go into the dangerous collapsing building. And, uh, what the fuck is going on here? Um. Okay. That seems natural down there. Um. You look like an extravagant fellow. Hello, sir. My name is Eugene, I think. Eugene? Oh. I'm on the trail of a Pokemon named Suicune. And you are? Ryan! Glad to meet you. I heard rumors that Suicune is here, so I came to look. Take a look at the basement through the hole in the floor. There. Suicune is down there! I could go downstairs, but I know it would run away in no time. I know. I have tried it many times. Okay, use using use. I'm definitely saying that wrong. And oh crap! What is the tag of me? That's a coffin. Certainly, it's not a shiny coffin. But it's, I mean, I haven't come across a shiny in a long, long fucking time. I can't even remember the last shiny I had or found. I think it might have been a been 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 barrel in a. Even my diamond or platinum. Um, anyway, my name is Morty. I'm the Echo Cheeks gym leader. Because my old friend Eugene is here on the trail of Suicune. And I decided to investigate the Burn Tower. Echo Cheek has a legend about these legendary Pokemon Suicune, Entei, and Raikou. As the gym leader of Echo Cheek, I must have a proper understanding of it. Oh. Well, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Who do I put out in front? Who do I want to put out in front? I'll put out you. So that's, uh. Hmm. Eugene said if we go down there, it's gonna run off, but. Fuck it, I don't care. Huh? Oh. Really? Is everyone here? Is this just one giant big fucking party of some sorts? You know, Professor Oak here somewhere? Oh, it's you. You must be here to catch a legendary Pokemon to make yourself look strong. That is only a dream. You see, the legendary Pokemon suits a trainer like me who has sworn to become the strongest trainer. A battle team Rocket's grunt is just right for you. Jeez, are you pissy much? Dude just comes up to me and insults me right to my face. And demands a battle. Hmm. Well, anyway, we'll go into details like I did the last time we fought him, but I haven't actually turned on my laptop. So, to look it up. So, yeah. It hanged out with 1 HP, are you fucking serious? 
Oh, uh, you. Oh, and I just used a fucking normal type move like a dumbass, because I was. I oh, I don't want to use another fun shot, because that would just be too crazy. I don't understand my fucking mind sometimes. Yeah, I know. I know it doesn't. So I just lose another quarter of health. It's fine. It's fucking brilliant. That's gonna lick me. MP is just getting fucked up all over. Hit it, please. Hit it. God damn it. Fuck. 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 And dead. Nope. But I am switching. Go, Smilia. Oh, look. Ah, fucking really? This game just des- Oh, okay. Mm, I see what's going on now. Yeah. Oh, he's doing the power fusion, guys. He's doing the power fusion. He's, he's, he wants- He wants me to fucking suffer. And despite being paralyzed and confused, still hit it. I love it. Anyway, Magnumide. So, switch a Rooney. Should just be fine. Okay, burn it. Burn the metal. Oh, yeah, there we go. Now, what's next? Crocodile. Um, yeah, I mean, MP is kind of, uh, can have a little fucked right now, so I'll put out sh right mm, shadow. Just because of shadow is supposed to be the defensive bastard he's supposed to be. Then he should be able to take a few hits whilst I uh, heal Amphi, I guess. There you go, Amphi. It's sprayed in the face with some chemicals. Oh, you missed with your scary face? What, were you looking at the fucking wall or something? I just, ah, with my scary face. It's like, uh, Crocodile, you're looking the wrong. You're looking, Crocodile. His face is already scary, so I don't know if trying to make an even scarier face is having no effect. Tell me it all finally happened. He finally saw where Amphi was and pulled off his scary face. To lower my speed. Yet, despite the fact that it moved first to do that, so that means it was faster than me to begin with. Okay, now I'm confused. Does, is, does, croc, does a little crocodile know his scary face now? Is this part of your master scheme, Devin? To be like the toughest trainer around by having your crocodile just learn only scary fish. Anyway, Zubat. Mine's a uh, crowbat now. That means I'm cool. Da -da 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 -da. Come on, fucking. Out of desperation, we pull, pull sometimes. You okay? Or something. Anyway, everything's faster than me, that's obviously no surprise. Probably should grind off screen in that case, and just to get a few more level ups over uh, the upcoming gym leader. Since if I recall, he is also kind of an ass. Not, not as big an ass as uh, winning, but hmm. I'm not fighting with another weakling ever again, it's just too much playing around. Okay. Uh, whatever. You would never be able to catch a legendary Pokemon anyway. Just okay, fine. Shove me out of the way. Could have just said, "Excuse me," but want to be a fucking prick about it, mother? What is it? Hello. Oh hi, Ryan. How are you? I'm fine, mother. I'm in a very dangerous building right now, battling complete assholes. How about you? I found a useful item while shopping, so I brought it with your money. Sorry, but I asked the delivery man to take it to you. Oh, well, how kind of you, making orders using my money. That doesn't sound remotely at all 
familiar to me in any way. And I got a fire breathing dude, so I'll put time more down the front, I guess. Just wanna grab this item, damn it. Don't worry. We fire breathers know the true power of fire better than anyone. <laughs> I was poisoned by that guy's coffins. I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap things up here for the time being. And next time we'll continue all on the way for this place. I guess. So anyway, see you guys then. <laughs>